A terrifying morning for a Wayne County mother. Her three-year-old got on the school bus but didn't make it to the classroom. Now school administrators in Worcester investigating and Derek Waller live there on 5 Force. He asked, how could this happen? Frank and Lee, it makes you wonder. Now a three-year-old fell asleep on the school bus on the way to preschool and was left there for about 30 minutes. That child was found on that bus inside this school maintenance yard and now the school bus driver could be facing some disciplinary charges. I had a few sleepless nights after that. That's after Worcester City School Superintendent Michael Tafts found out a three-year-old preschooler disappeared last Wednesday morning, eventually found asleep on an empty school bus in this maintenance yard. Dr. Tafts says the district's legal counsel is investigating what failed. It looks to us that uh, the, the post inspection uh, was not completed. Meaning the driver, whose name is not being released, never checked to see if there were still kids on the bus as required by Ohio law. The child's mother is a Worcester City Schools teacher. She received a phone call from Littlest Generations Preschool located inside Cornerstone Elementary. Her child never arrived. So the driver went back and checked the bus and found that child still asleep. Those families entrust us with the safety of their children every day. And in this particular situation, we, we let that, the district let that family down. And that would be very scary. This Worcester grandmother says she understands mistakes happen, but thinks the driver should be reprimanded. I tell you, if one of my daughter in laws knew that, they'd be. <laughs> We'd be in trouble. Dr. Tefts told me there will be a hearing to determine if the bus driver should be punished. In the meantime, he says employees are reviewing procedures. Something that uh, we're going to work real diligently to make sure it doesn't happen again. And again, we want to make sure it's clear that child is okay, never needed any medical attention. We also want to let you know that we put in a public records request with the school district. We're trying to find out that bus driver's name and if they've had any previous issues at work. We're live in Worcester tonight. Derek Waller, News Channel 5.